newly crowned U.S. Open champion Novak Djokovic says he is thrilled by his success in the majors this season. Ray Consolacion will tell us why. Novak Djokovic closed out the Grand Slam campaign in style, beating longtime rival Roger Federer to claim the U.S. Open on Sunday, leaving the Serb a hair away from one of the greatest seasons of all time. The 6-4, 5-7, 6-4, 6-4 victory gave Djokovic three of the year's four Grand Slam titles with a loss to Stan Wawrinka in the French Open final, his only blemish. Although there was no way to tell how big his four-set loss to Wawrinka would be, it ended up denying the Serb a chance to join the men's calendar year Grand Slam club that includes just two members, Rod Laver and Don Budge. It has been the best Grand Slam uh, season ever in my career, so I'm trying to, to cherish it and trying to enjoy every moment. It was the 10th career major for Djokovic, but only his second U.S. Open. These are the tournaments that you always dream of winning, and this is uh, the tournament that count the most in our sport. Uh, those are the ones that, uh, that are on your, on your wall, you know, when you're, when you're a kid uh, growing up and, and, and imagining yourself to, to, be a, to be a champion in tennis and you want to lift U.S. Open, Wimbledon, Roland Garros, Australian Open. The 28-year-old Serb had known more frustrations than success on the Flushing Meadows hard courts, having previously reached the final five times and lifting the trophy just once in 2011. Meeting for the 42nd time, the rivalry between the elegant Swiss and the dominating Djokovic has developed into one of the sporting world's best and the latest installment, perhaps fittingly, deadlocked the head-to-head -head series at 21-all. Ray Consolacion reporting for Y News.